What do you do, YouTube? It's your boy Mike from NYC, and we back with another reaction. Today we are watching Winning Time, The Rise of the Lakers Dynasty official trailer. Uh, man, this is going to be interesting, man. This, I feel like this could have came out years ago. Honestly, this could have came out in the two in the early 2000s, you know what I mean? Once Magic officially like wasn't hooping no more. But I feel like they came out with it now and I feel like now is the time where, you know, they got to they got to execute. They they've had let's see Magic was drafted in 80, he retired in the early 90s. It's 2022 they've had 30 years of no Magic, no Bird, no Showtime, no Kareem, no nobody to just get this shit right. And now is the time to execute. This movie's gonna go down in the books, probably. And for the people that don't really know what happened in that time, really firsthand, like people like myself, are gonna refer to this movie in some regard. So you gotta get it right. There's no, there's no bullshit. Money on the line, stakes at the highest. You feel me? Let's get it. I don't care who you are. If you're a human being with two eyes and a heart, this game, this industry, makes you feel good. I don't know about all that. What industry? Sweat socks? No! Show business! Hey, Dr. Buzz. I'm going to buy the Lakers. Ah, no kidding. Welcome to sunny Los Angeles. Great for tans. Tell them to win a championship one of these days. Shit for fans. We are trading in an empire of real estate for what? The entire league is on the verge of bankruptcy. Shut up, Frank. Word, shut up. Dad, I want to work for you. All right, let's have an interview. Summer draft. Right, the Lakers get top pick. Right, so who do I pick? It's easy. The show's stopping. Local phenom. Naturally gifted urban magic. Do not use that nickname in this house. She said magic, the devil's work. The devil can't hoop like me, though. Do they even have churches? Did he really say that? Because that's, that's mad funny. Los Angeles. Los Angeles Lakers select Magic Johnson. Us together, Magic and Kareem. Oh, well, Kareem and Magic. Every team's got fans. We'll have celebrities. Our girls, they won't cheer. They'll dance. You think I'm gonna get out there? You think it's gonna change you? I wanna build something special. A real dynasty. For her out, man. Leave the dynasties to me. Yo, what's up, Larry? Come on, Red. You afraid of competition? No, but you're no competitor. From here on out, we are playing to win! You don't have family. You have fallout. We've got a shot here to win it all. You know how rare that is. What do you want for your future? Every day. It's showtime. It's funny how in a lot of basketball movies, like, when you see movements like this, a lot of it is exaggerated. It's hard to really exaggerate what Magic was doing on that court. Because Magic was out here doing anything. Like, honestly, they didn't even do Magic justice. Usually in the movies, it's more like, you know, high school, music school. Like, everything's exaggerated. Like, Magic, you couldn't... I don't know if you could really exaggerate what he was doing. But I do... I do like the fact that they had... um. I do like the fact that they had Larry Bird in here. I like how in inseparable they are. You know, even when it comes to the movies, they had to give him a little, you feel me? A little, a little love. You know, obviously it's something that they want to make entertaining first. Obviously they, they need to make money off it first. You know, so the trailer is going to be more of the entertaining parts. And obviously I don't want to watch a boring movie, but I also do want to, I do want to be able to look at this movie and learn some things that I didn't know about whatever was going on back then. You know, and, you know, actually thinking about it now, like, with all the, the girls and the drugs, like, honestly, bro, if I was Magic, bro, I probably would have had HIV too, bro, don't cap. 
There ain't no way, bro. Like, you got the pick of the litter, bro. You in L.A., right? Probably the biggest city in the United States at the time. You are the big. You're in the biggest city. You're the biggest name on the biggest team. Six nine point guard. Like this nigga was just literally goaded. You think about all the things that he that he was at the time. Plus the smile, the charisma. You know what I mean? It honestly, bro. It would have been. It would have been a miracle if he didn't get HIV, bro. You know what I'm saying? So I do. You know. So just thinking about that, like realistically, I f I feel like. You know what I'm saying? I don't feel him have HIV, but I, I understand I understand what was going on for me. But I'm definitely going to watch this movie. Definitely like, comment, share, and subscribe. Be like these type of videos, and I will see you when I see you. Peace.